Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everyone. Hope you are doing well. My name is Dennis, and welcome to my channel. In this episode today, I want to tour one of the oldest area in Mombasa. I'm talking about Chuda. So I'll be going to that area, and I'll be showing you uh, around the area, the social amenities around the area. And at the end of the video, I will tell you the advantages of you living in the area. So stay tuned to the end of the video so that you can know more about the area. So let's go to Chuda. Across the Nyali Bridge, uh, as you can see on my background, that's the Nyali Bridge, one of the longest bridges that connects you from uh, the Mombasa uh, mainland to Mombasa Island, which is 400 meters. This bridge is 400 meters. So I've just crossed the bridge uh, from the north coast, and I'll be heading uh, to the other side where Chuda is, and there is where I'll be doing the tour. So uh, crossing this road, I know that uh, uh, now, nowadays we have so many flyovers here in Mombasa and uh, it is very easy for someone to cross the highway. But uh, today I'm using the tunnel. There is a uh, walking tunnel. Uh, uh, just below this bridge is a walking tunnel whereby you can uh, walk through that tunnel and uh, go to the other side. So let's go to the walking tunnel so that we can cross to the other side. So guys, here is the tunnel. And this is the Nyali Bridge. So guys, this is the tunnel, this is the walking tunnel that helps you to cross uh, to the other side of, uh, of this uh, road, the Nyali Bridge Road. It is not that a long tunnel but uh, it helps people to just cross easily to the other side. And voila, we are on the other side of the road. We have used this tunnel to cross and we are on the other side of the road and this area is called Buxton so guys it is a sunny day uh, I've just uh, uh, started entering Chuda and uh, I'm in this road here I don't know the name of the road but uh, this road here takes you to the interior and inside Chuda and uh, Chuda is close to the Mombasa town so here is the road entering Chuda this is the road entering Chuda so let's go and uh, tour the area it's an amazing area it has so many social amenities. It is a cool area, a so quiet area. Uh, very nice. And it is close to the Indian Ocean, guys. And another advantage of, uh, of you living in Chuda, uh, you get uh, to access the beach very easily. Uh, we have estates uh, around Chuda because Chuda is very, very wide uh, area. So we have different areas here with different estates like this estate. When you take this road, you enter to this kind of estates here. All of these are estates, beautiful buildings on the other side, so many businesses uh, uh, around this area. As you can see, there are so many, so many businesses around this area. Also here in Chuda, you can find uh, one of the biggest polytechnic, one of the biggest college uh, in Mombasa. I'm talking about TUM, uh, the Technical University of Mombasa. Uh, a long time ago, it was called uh, Mombasa Polytechnic. Uh, but right now we call it tomb so I can see so many business uh, on my background these businesses are uh, opened here these are, are uh, eating uh, uh, joints uh, like hotels small hotels and uh, uh, restaurants uh, these businesses are open are have been opened here because of uh, the Mombasa Polytechnic uh, because uh, most of the students are uh, always come out here during the lunch time and take their meal around this area so that's why there are so many so many um, uh, restaurants and hotels around this area so that's the reason so let's go and uh, let me show you the Mombasa Polytechnic which is called TUM right now the Technical University of Mombasa uh, so guys we are close to the Technical University of Mombasa we have another school here which is called BZB uh, this is one of the 
best schools here in Mombasa. This is the Busy Bee School. And on the other side is where you can find uh, the biggest university in Mombasa, which is called Tum. So this is Tum. Those are the gates of uh, the Technical University of Mombasa, which is called Tum. The Technical University of Mombasa Tum. And guys, I just love this road uh, right here, whereby you can get these uh, beautiful trees uh, right here. Very cool trees and wonderful trees. And it is so, so amazing. I just love this area. It is so cool, so nice. We have a church here which is called Fellowship Baptist Church. So guys, another uh, social amenities that you can find in the area are uh, churches and uh, secondary schools, like the one on, on my background here. This is called, this, uh, these fences uh, are for the Hamisi Secondary Schools, one of the best schools in Mombasa. Uh, one of the best secondary schools in Mombasa. So that's uh, one of the gates of Hamisi Secondary School. You can see? The area is so much nice tarmac road very nice entering uh, through the area so when you are driving uh, from uh, Pakistan uh, just close to the Nyali bridge entering through the this road is very very smooth very very nice and also Tum, uh, Tum University which is uh, the technical university of Mombasa it is very wide it, it goes all through until the Indian Ocean and the shores of the Indian Ocean on the, on the other side and when you are in uh, Nyali bridge you can see this university and most of the uh, rich people also live in Judah uh, because it has best uh, estates and uh, best uh, apartments uh, and hotels also in this area um, so yeah so many roads entering Chuda like this road here takes you to other side of Chuda you have these uh, nice uh, buildings uh, and apartments on the other side but today we'll just use the main road all of this is still uh, this is one of the mosques around this area look at this beautiful building right here very nice Things have uh, just gone to normal because uh, we had election just on the other day and uh, uh, people are afraid of just open, opening their businesses because uh, we have been having a, a trouble with our election. Every time and again we have election we have chaos. Uh, but now I'm very very happy because uh, uh, I can see some, most of the businesses are open. Everything is still going on as normal. I'm so amazed with this road here in Chuda because it is very very smooth and uh, so much have changed in this area. I can see tall buildings, I can see wonderful uh, hotels and restaurants in this area, uh, beautiful streets on the other side. So it is so amazing and very very nice. Oh my god. Look at this nice and beautiful apartment. Wow. And it is very very nice and uh, it is very close to the road this apartment here is called moha apartment uh, i don't know much about this apartment here but it's called moha apartment i think one of the best apartments here in this area another one is this one here oh nice beautiful wow look at this i think uh construction is still going on in this area because i can see we have this a very tall apartment uh here in the area of chuda look at this this is very very tall guys very very tall i think it's uh, like 20 floors or more but it's also it is close to this uh road here so wow this is very nice i think this is gonna be one of the tallest uh building here in the area of chuda and I'm very amazed about this uh, this road here because uh, you have this um, a nice pedestrian uh, path whereby uh, it separates you from the, the road where cars have been uh, driven. So you can walk here very easily and very, very nice without any worries of you hit by a car. This is a very amazing building right here. I don't know how uh the constructor the construction of this house came through but wow this is very nice this is a very nice building oh 
don't know what has happened right here but uh, uh, they are like uh, something that has collapsed uh, and there's a car that has uh, this uh, iron sheet has collapsed on the car I don't know what has happened right here but uh, it is not our business right now we're just moving on the construction is still going on in these areas I think these are uh, apartments I like the graffiti all of this are construction uh, so guys the advantages that you can find when you you live in Chuda is one you get a very easy access to the Mombasa town which is the Mombasa CBD uh, and, and the other thing is uh, uh, you are very close to the Coast General Hospital that one of the biggest hospital here in uh, Mombasa so if you have an emergency or if you want uh, medical care uh, you are very close to the Mombasa Coast General Hospital and in Mombasa town is where you can find so many businesses and uh, uh, so many jobs opportunities so when you are very close to the Mombasa town it is very easy for you to uh, just access all those uh, opportunities when you live in a uh, area and uh, you also say fair also if you are you are you are working in town uh, and it is very close to uh, town you say fair because it is like a 30 bob or uh, something like that to get to town or if you are you don't want to use uh, the matatu you can just walk to town because it is very close to town so yes that's just few of the advantages uh, of you living in Chuda guys I mean I'm still moving on and we have this uh, very tall apartment around Chuda this is very nice wow look at this very nice building with a very big parking lot and all of these streets leads you to uh, the private properties and the estates around this area of Chuda but I'm still using this main road because this main road takes you uh, all around Chuda uh, to the other part of uh, of Mombasa which is uh, Sparky and uh, Makupa so this is the main road I've just asked and uh, the, uh, the way to the Indian Ocean and uh, they have just shown me where the Indian Ocean is and the road that takes you to the Indian Ocean now I'll be heading there so that I can show you look at this this road you this road here takes you to the Indian Ocean uh, as I told you that Chuda is uh, very very much close to the Indian Ocean so I'll be taking you there so that I can show you wow I can just uh, feel the breeze from the Indian Ocean and the smell of the water so wow so beautiful nice let us have this beautiful view of this Indian Ocean right here wow look at this this is nice and amazing as I'm just uh, close to the beach as you can see this wonderful and beautiful view uh, of this Chuda area the beach of Chuda area this is amazing and uh, we have these stairs that takes you down to the show uh, because uh, it is we are just on the higher side I'll see these stairs right here this comes from the road that I showed you entering this uh, uh, this uh, uh, ocean area uh, the area is where you can find the beach and you can use just these stairs just going down until to the shore of this uh, ocean right here so this is amazing so if you are living in Chuda uh, you are living in this area of Chuda you have this easy access to the beach whereby you can just go there and swim and have good time look at these streets beautiful streets of Chuda houses close to the main road so guys we are just uh, uh, in this uh, nice uh, one of the social amenities you can found you can find in this area of Chuda this is the Chuda water sport uh, marine craft uh, we have uh, a restaurant right here and accommodation rooms for people just to uh, to rent and stay uh, this is the Chuda water sport if you enter and if you take this road it takes you to the Chuda water sport that's the gates of the Chuda water sport it is very close to the Indian Ocean when I was just close to the Indian Ocean uh, on the other side uh, you, you saw uh, some boats uh, some uh, uh, speed boats 
uh, those are the boats that you can find in the Chuda water sport. So if you're a fan of uh, um, going to the beach and uh, have some fun with the boats, you can just come to Chuda water sport and uh, you just have a nice time there. Guys, this is a secondary school. It's called St. Augustine Mixed Day and Boarding School. Wow. So this is one of the social amenities around this area, the St. Augustine uh, Mixed Boarding and Day School. Very, very big, very close to the uh, Indian Ocean. All of these wonderful and beautiful apartments and buildings here in Chuda. We have so many businesses around this area. Uh, car garages, uh, repairing uh, the cars around this area. All of these are garages and the businesses on the other side. I'm very amazed because I haven't seen any Maram Road around this area of Chuda. So I'm in this beautiful and wonderful area of Chuda. So many people around here. I think this is the uh, this is the stage, uh, this, uh, the Chuda stage. And on my background here we have uh, this uh, very tall building. Wow, this is nice. I'm told that this area is called Chuda Mwisho. Uh, this is where all the matatus come from town and uh, turn right here heading back to town. So this is Chuda Mwisho, that's why there are so many people around this area. The stages, beautiful apartments and uh, beautiful tall buildings around these areas. So many people, wow. This road here takes you to the residential. We have uh, small uh, vegetable vendors and businesses around this area. So wow, this is nice. So this road takes you to the estates and uh, private properties. So many businesses around this area of Chuda. Wow. This is nice. So guys, these are the streets of Chuda. This is amazing building right here. I think these are apartments right here. This building is very tall. So I've entered uh, some of the streets, like these streets here. These are streets heading to private properties here in Chuda. Wow, this is a very nice building right here. It has an underground. Wow. So these streets take you to back to uh, the Tomb University, the Technical University of Mombasa. Uh, we have these beautiful apartments. I think the, those apartments right there are still under construction. Yeah. This is just one of the streets uh, of, uh, of uh, Chuda. And look how amazing these streets are. The roads are nicely constructed. It is tarmac road. Uh, very beautiful. And see all these nice buildings right here, beautiful buildings, amazing. If you are living in Mombasa and uh, or if you are living in Kenya, you have heard about Chuda Jumbalawaze. Uh, so let me cross the road so that I can show you uh, Chuda Nyumba Yawaze. I've, I've been hearing this saying that uh, when you call a, a person Wenimze, uh, they always tell you that Waze Wako Chuda. Uh, because here in Chuda is where you can find that Nyumba Yawaze. I can see this one is the Chuda Nyumba Yawaze. Here it is, the Chuda Nyumba Yawaze. This is the poster right here, Nyumba Yawaze. Here is where you find uh, the charity people who are keeping uh, the old people right here. The people, uh, the old people who uh, can't take care of themselves. Uh, they have been served in this area, in this uh, property right here, with very beautiful, wonderful people. So yeah, that's the true Danyumba Yawaze. Uh, I just asked around and uh, uh, the, the residents of this area told me that there are the different kind of section here in Chuda. We have the Chuda Nora, uh, Chuda A, uh, we have the Chuda B, and we have the Chuda Moroto. Yeah? Uh, Chuda A, a B, and uh, Chuda Nora is where the rich people live. Uh, and those middle-class people live but the Chuda Moroto is a, a different case uh, I don't want to talk more about that but it is a different uh, case of uh, uh, those people who uh, are just wale uh, uh, also Chuda is close to uh, the Sparky area and the Makupa area so I'm still in this road uh, that uh, came from the Chuda 
uh, Mwisho, whereby we have that uh, very group of uh, um, people around that area. Uh, I, asked, I asked around and they told me that's the boundary of you being separated from the Chuda A, B and the Chuda Nora from the Chuda Moroto. So there is where you find that boundary and the section. And uh, also I have noticed that there is where the Matatus that come from uh, the Mombasa CBD turns again going back to the Mombasa CBD. So they come from Mombasa CBD uh, to Chuda Mwisho, then they turn and go back to the Mombasa CBD. So that's that's why that area is called Chuda Mwisho. So this is one of the academies around this area of uh, close to Chuda, the Makupo Academy, PCEA, one of the social amenities close to uh, Chuda area. Wow, look at this shopping center, Nyama Heaven. This is beautiful, guys. Wow, look at this. This is wonderful. It's called Nyama Heaven. I guess this is where you can get uh, the best meat here in the area of Makupa, close to Chuda area. The Nyama Heaven. Wow. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video until the end. As I told you, the advantages of you living in Chuda are uh, you get the easy access to the Mombasa CBD, uh, the Coast General Hospital. Uh, Chuda area has so much social amenities. We have petrol station. Uh, we have uh, a Chuda water spot. You are very close to the Indian Ocean. You have the biggest university in Mombasa, which is TUM, the Technical University of Mombasa. Those are the biggest advantages you can find around uh, Chuda area. Also, we have uh, uh, nice apartments, very beautiful uh, tarmac streets in Chuda. So this is very amazing. And uh, I got to have fun uh, touring Chuda area. And here I'm in Makupa area. I'm ending this video telling you guys that thank you so much for watching this video till the end. And uh, hope to see you in the next video. And if you like the video, kindly subscribe to my channel. Give my channel a thumbs up uh, and uh, share to your family members and your friends uh, so that they can know all about uh, how true the area is. So thank you so much uh, for watching this video till the end and I will see you in the next video. Bye for today and for now.